escape the place when we speak about people, structures and organizations. Here we meet good people, speak about challenges in HR and the future of HR and come up with a lot of insights. So today my guest is a very interesting person and professional and his name is Krzysztof Ogonowski. So my first question is because people want to know who you are and what you do. So yes. please share. Uh, I am a change management professional. Mm -hmm. I run a company that helps other companies to implement major changes to support their business. So I need your perspective. What do you think? Uh, what will be the main challenges in the world that HR people are going to face? in the nearest future? I think it's connected with surfing. Oh, uh, let me explain I love surfing. Yes, good, yes. good, good, good. <laughs> so that's, that's why I'm happy I found a good analogy. So what I mean by that, uh, I think that HR, for example, in the change processes that I'm supporting, definitely can play significant role. Mm -hmm. um, not only in implementation of the project simple changes but also building strategic capability mm -hmm. so that organization can absorb more changes mm -hmm. and do them faster successfully. Mm -hmm. What our HR should learn to overcome this because this is something they have to have enough skills and mm -hmm. capabilities to, to overcome. It. I would say that the good news is that not always it's about learning totally new things. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's rather using existing resources mm -hmm. like uh, HR business partner network, mm -hmm. like HR recognition in the business. Mm -hmm. And I think, for example, in this case, I would say uh, first step would be for HR to learn or to absorb existing change management methodologies. Mm -hmm. So that HR can be helpful on delivering business value on the project. Mm -hmm. Do you think that HR people should go for change management certification to get these tools? Well, I would say, I would be not objective if I say so. Yeah, but, 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 but you know, generally <coughs> in everything you do, the first step is to learn how to do it. Okay. And then, so that's why I would say certification itself, maybe it's not an objective, a mm -hmm. goal, mm -hmm. but the goal is to learn something that is structured, mm -hmm. that you can apply one, one time, second time, third time, repeatedly, that you can build common language with other people in the organization around. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, Arvind. My pleasure.